What's going on, everybody? So a little bit of a mix of a video. You're going to see part of a mail day and then a five-card PSA order that I had out there. Um, been a little busy, and sorry, I do apologize. The older pug's barking because I forgot to give her treats. All right. So um, within the last, like, two weeks, there was actually two deaths I know of in the sports card community. First was uh, Archie Klein, who was the promoter for both Plainsville and, and, and Plainsville and Martinsville, Indiana. Uh, card show and I know the funeral uh, happened the Saturday I was in Louisville set up because a couple people left out early to go up to it and then just last well I guess you could say yeah last night I was trying to think when I'm posting this so I think this will probably come out same day I'm making it if not it would have been on Monday night um, Jacob uh, from the Monster Den passed away so just been kind of crazy seeing like people that you know you talk to all the time and they're just you know passing away but other than that that's why i wanted to kind of make this into a regular video because uh, i got some stuff i got to work on where where uh, a couple of us are going to work to try to get some stuff done for jacob here but as i said there i don't even know where my butt was going see it shows my mind's all flabbergasted here guys all right, we're going to start with breaks. So, <laughs> I hit, I won the Phillies in a filler type deal. I, I I sucked with the Phillies. As you can see, there's some Aiden Millers. If it's in this stack, right now it's probably going to Com C. So, you guys know. I hit some Heredia guy. Heredia guy? Heredia? 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 Yeah, that's how you say it. Or Heredia. I'm going to say it's Heredia. Auto. I had the Penguins in a 42-box break. Let me tell you how awful it is to watch a 42-box break of just miscellaneous stuff. All right, so this was out of 49. Um, Anthony Angelo. Got a Pierre Oliver Joseph. I thought this was numbered. It might be on the back without hitting the camera. Maybe not. Um, Zahorna. Poland. Gensel. Thumbered Crosby, Lemieux. There's uh, Pustetin. Nothing real crazy in here at all. I mean, again, I hit this on a filler spot, so I wasn't really much filler for the, basically the Penguins only. All right, so those there are definitely all going to come. See, then we had a Revolution break that came in the mail. Starting off, we have... Uh, Rui, I think, is out of like one, yeah, 149. Then we got two 125s, a Lewis, Anthony Davis. No idea. I think this is the variation or something. I, I'll have to go look. Calvin Murphy Auto. Um, one of these is a fractal, so it's this one here. Amen, 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 Thompson. I always mess his name up. Uh, another uh, Jacques Jr. That should be fractal. All right, so that stuff there is basically just like my Com C pile. I'm starting back up again. Stuff I probably might grade. Young Guns Lud Ludwig. This dude was being a beast for the Penguins. Uh, then we got Pustin and Young Guns, Pustin and Canvas. I, I like this guy. If you watched, um, I know a lot of you guys don't watch hockey, so I don't even know why I'm, I'm doing this. But uh, he was playing. I want to say it was for Finland. Anyhow, he was putting up some points. Drake May, first Bowman. I believe it's out of four ninety nine. That come from KTA Breaks. Another Amen. There it is. Amen Thompson. <laughs> I keep on coming out with Amen. That's a fractal auto out of one hundred. That'll probably go get graded. A lot of these are like I might get graded type deals. Some for myself. Uh, last card. This was a win. Anthony Davis, National Treasures, out of 49.95, 10 auto. I just got to change the case out onto it. Look at that thick-ass Beckett thing. This here could be a weapon, man. If you chuck this at somebody stealing something at your table, you could cause some freaking damage. All right, this is what I got graded. So welcome to PSA order. This was a, I think I did as a value. Um, I got upcharged on the card, and we'll talk about that when it comes. Up first, 
Picked this up from Joey. It was um, a redemption. It came in the mail. Donruss Optic Hero Fast Break. I don't know. This guy just keeps going every which way. But, nine. Everybody's favorite king, De'Aaron Fox. Gem Mint 10. Sexy, huh? Uh, 25. I didn't want to give the wrong number. I thought it was out of 25. The Upcharge. Monopoly, what do they call this? Money Blast. It's not a color blast because it comes out of Monopoly. It's a money blast. PSA 10, last two sales, 1800. Very, very low pop, pop, uh, pop count on that, of course. Of course, they had to get my money. My money. Former Pittsburgh Penguin Paul Coffey out of five from Artifacts. This is just in his um, all star uniform, so. I'm guessing this would have been during Red Wings time, more than likely. Yeah. And finally, I had this raw. I tried it. I thought it had a chance at a 10. I figured it was a strong 9. It got to 9. Out of 10, Ken Griffey Jr., 56 home run, autograph. Still like a 400-some dollar card on to that, so never, never mad. Um... Pretty good overall with PSA. I mean, they're all nine or better. Two tens. The one... Oh, I know I wanted to show you guys. So, this has been a question coming up recently that a lot of us have been talking about. Let me see if I could find this. Okay. If you look here in this De'Aaron Fox, well, it's going to be kind of hard to see. I'm going to get the focus. We've always been asked questions if the sticker surface is going to count. And if I can get right there, do you guys see where my pen tip is? It's real hard to see being the case, but there was a little bubble that was right there. Like where they put the sticker on right, it's still got a 10. So, this is the second time I've done this, and both times have been 10s. I'm not telling you everyone's going to be good. See, you can almost see it right... Let me see if I back it up and then pull it in for you guys. As soon as I start changing the view. Ah. Yeah, it's because of the glare. As soon as it starts hitting it, it wants to not keep it going. But yeah, it's real hard to see, but it, it's on there. It's a nice bubble. But yeah, I just thought I'd bring that up because it's always been a question out there. You know, does it kill a grade? Does it not? I've done two so far. I both tend them, so I'm guessing stickers like that there that are just jacked up and it's really not part of the card, I guess they're not docking. I don't know. But other than that, everybody, I appreciate y'all watching the video. Uh, let me get to our schedule out here for you guys. This weekend, Lexington, Kentucky. The following Saturday, Louisville, Kentucky. And then the Friday and Saturday after that, Indianapolis, Indiana for the Midwest Monster. I will be bringing some rare cars. I don't usually bring the shows up there. I actually already had somebody reach out to me. They didn't even know him. I'm guessing the promoter uh, did say he was going to try to link me up with some guys. And uh, we already have a deal in place for a nice stack of cards. So I told him meet me Thursday night at the hotel. And surprisingly, we're both staying in the same hotel. Kind of cool, though. But other than that, guys, if you got any of the shows, stop by, say hello, as always. Uh, Midwest Monster, you have to find me. And once I get there, I'll try to get a quick YouTube video out just to show you guys. In case anybody pops through, wants to come down. If you get bored, tired, hot, you want to sit down, you bought too much, you need to leave at the table, you can. Not stuff like that, as always. But other than that, guys, I am out. I will catch you guys next video.